the death toll a spike again to 619 extra deaths over the last 24 hours. And that really comes after yesterday's uh, death toll was the lowest in about three weeks at 510 uh, people. It seemed to be encouraging news yesterday. Uh, but we have seen these slight uh, peaks and troughs. Uh, generally, the health authorities insist that there is evidence that the curve is flattening out. Uh, the death toll really rose 3.8%, uh, and that is uh, uh, down on some of the rises we've seen in uh, recent days. Uh, in terms of the number of people infected, we saw 5,169 uh, more people infected, and that's a rise of about uh, almost 3% to 166,000. Of course, Spaniards are aware now that uh, some people are not showing up in those figures, uh, particularly since some of the regions have uh, complained and pointed out that the number of people uh, being buried has climbed uh, significantly since the coronavirus crisis. And what they're saying is a lot of those deaths must uh, include people who had the virus. Uh, so we're expecting that there may be some, at some point, some updated figures. There's also often a weekend effect uh, where uh, hospitals aren't able to report their figures. So we may see uh, some more bad news trickling through on the Monday and the Tuesday. It's a very odd Easter for the Spaniards who are normally out in mass at those Easter processions as uh, they've all had to be cancelled. Uh, but as you mentioned, from Monday, uh, some of those non-essential workers who can't work from home uh, will be allowed back to the offices and the factories. And the government's been criticised for that uh, uh, from some quarters, people saying, is it too soon to, to be doing that? Uh, but the government has said that the uh, brief period of what they termed economic hibernation uh, is working and that we won't really see the impact of that on the figures uh, until a, a couple of weeks' time. They insist that uh, the confinement measures that are still in place and will be in place till April the 26th are very strict. Spaniards can't go out for a walk or exercise, for instance, like in some countries, and they insist they are really making an impact.